Hey guys, Dean here, back again. It's been a while, I know. Um, so yeah, quite a few people have done videos uh, already. We had a VC meetup, which was my first VC meetup actually, in Leeds. Uh, that was at the beginning of October, so it's been a while now. Uh, as quite a few people have shown videos and so forth. I haven't got around to doing one yet, so I suppose this is sort of it. Uh, as far as records go, I didn't really pick much up on the day. Um, picked up a couple of albums, uh, Joan Jett albums as it were, uh, that actually have them to hand. Um, but nothing else really. I was going to do a video around just sort of the whole day sort of things. Um, but I think everybody else has pretty much said what happened. Um, the only thing really of any relevance um, in the morning that people haven't mentioned is I got there quite early actually. So I think the fair was due to start at 10 o'clock or 10.30 or something like that. Um, I'd spoken to Martin Parrott early doors in the morning and he said he was on his way um, and I think I got into Leeds probably for about 10 o'clock you know I parked the car up and headed over to the church which was probably about 10 minutes away anyway so I waited just outside the church it's just on the edge of a shopping centre so I was sort of on the back to the church and I was just expecting him to come through on a park and ride bus so I was basically on the the main um, road uh, where the buses stop essentially so I waited around for a while, I know about half an hour, and I think he should have been here by now. So I texted him, sort of saying, "Have you got lost? Did you get on the wrong bus? No answer, nothing." Anyway, so it got to about eleven o'clock, um, or just gone past eleven, and then James Griffiths turned up. I said to him, "I can't believe you're the first person that's actually turned up after me." So half expecting like loads of other people to turn up, and he said, "Nobody else here yet." I said, "Well, no, not by the looks of things." Anyway, so we decide. I haven't had any answer from Martin, John Bellamy was still on the way. I thought, okay, let's go into the record fair. You'll know where it is, you'll find it anyway. So anyway, go into the record fair. Hey presto, Martin's already there. Um, digging through the crates. <laughs> Introduced myself and he apologised. So oh, I must have got the wrong end of the stick anyway. So I don't know how he managed to get in. He literally must have walked through the shopping centre. Um, or I just managed to look the wrong way when I was looking at the buses. Um, and just managed to sneak straight past me. But anyway, that's life. Um, I did mention it to my partner Jessica when I came back in uh, at the end of the day. And she says, that's just so you. Uh, that's just stuff that just tends to happen to you. So anyway, it was a pleasant day uh, standing outside for an hour or so, so uh, not to worry. Um, but I didn't pick anything up at the fair. Anyway, it was one of the other record shops that um, I managed to pick something up on. Um, anyway. The reason I mentioned Martin anyway is that he kindly sent me a message the other day saying um, give me your address, I've got some VCLT to send you. So rather than which on about Leeds, um, here's VC. So I've not opened it yet Martin so I haven't a clue what you've um, sent me. Uh, I did ask you to put your address on there which you have done so I shall send you something in return. Um, I did have something in mind anyway and I had ummed and out about sending them um, bringing something with me on the fair but uh, I was rushing around in the morning anyway so I didn't bother um, so let's see anyway let's see how we're going to get into this for a start uh, there isn't any obvious um, opening on this so I'm just going to have to go with it essentially and try and uh, get into said package sealed it down the side here Maybe I should have thought about this before I started the video. Oh, I can feel an opening at the bottom. Okay, it's a, it's a pizza star box. It's nice and easy when you actually uh, figure it out. So yeah, chatting to the guys. Um, as everybody else said, it's fantastic meeting up with them. Uh, went around to a few record shops. Uh, one record shop which I didn't want to, uh, didn't get to go to was... Um, Noises for Heroes, which is pretty much on the other side of town, um, next to the um, Leeds General Infirmary, uh, which is a fantastic record shop. Um, so maybe next time. Uh, yeah, nice note from uh, Martin there, so I shall uh, read that later. Um, may give away what's uh, in the package. Let's have a look. Plenty of bubble wrap. Let's put this down. Thing film. It's like Christmas, we'll just rip through it. And we'll 
get in there. I do like to open the VCLT stuff live as it were, so then you do get an element of surprise. It's a warts and all, so if I'm going to hate it, you'll see it on my face. If I haven't a clue what you've sent me, again, you'll see on my face. Um, <laughs> awesome. So funny. Um, thank you, Martin, for sending me this. Uh, however, somebody else has already beaten you to the post. Um, I had a copy of this from um, Miko in the vinyl corner. Uh, so I won a competition going back, um, well, it's probably a good six months now. Um, and the competition essentially was for him to, um, well, I think the two winners essentially. Um, so he picked out the two videos. Um, we both got a prize, but um, one of my prizes was this, uh, and there was another prize, um, which was a prog rock album. So this album is um, it's pretty much like a sort of death metal, black metal album. Um, I never really know the difference between the two, to be fair. Um, and I've listened to it a couple of times, actually. I need to send Miko a message because I noticed uh, a couple of days ago that he'd sent me a message. It's asking... Um, if I'd listen to it again and uh, what I thought to it as well. Because I had an initial listen actually last time I did the video. Um, but yeah, this is a cracking album. So uh, thank you, Martin. And uh, yeah, it's not normally the stuff I listen to, but I think as I said to Mika the first time around, um, sort of getting more into sort of that sort of vocal style now with um, listening to Opeth and going back to their back catalogue. Um, really loving the early stuff. Um, but yeah. This is a really good album, um, and I do know somebody actually who's going to appreciate this, so it will go to a good home. Um, as much as I'd love to keep hold of this, the copy that Miko sent was also signed. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if he was... Um... Yeah, he picked it up while he was in Finland anyway. Um, yeah, he said his morning tonight, which etc. Um, yeah, fantastic, Martin. Thanks for certainly thinking of me. Like I say, we'll pass it on. It'll go back onto the uh, Vinyl Community Love Train. First class, along to somebody else. Um, but I'll make sure I get something across to you anyway. So, thank you very much. Um, I'm going to hopefully try and do another video this weekend anyway, because I've got a few more bits that I'd like to show. Uh, and talk about um, but until then thanks guys uh, we'll see you soon thanks bye